Sometimes you will be asked to sketch or draw something in an online class. Some people will find it easy to hand draw objects and models and then take a picture to upload them to their assignment. But other people will prefer to use a computer to make digital sketches. I'm going to quickly show you how to use Sketchpad. First, you will need to install the Chrome extension. The link to that is in the description below. Once you have it pulled up, you'll see a screen like this. If you click the plus button, you can change the size of the drawing and you can choose a different background. I like to use the transparent background so it can be overlaid on other images, but you can use whichever one you want. I'm not going to show you how to use everything, but I'm going to show you how to get started. Up here at the top, you have the cursor button, which just allows you to click and choose things, the crop button if you're working with images, and the zoom button. Below that, you have your, have your drawing or writing tools, shapes, text boxes, images, and background fill. Let me show you how to use the different drawing tools. When you click on the drop down menu, you'll see tons of options here. Pick the one that you like. Below, you'll see two color options, fill and outline. The outline is the color of the pen or the paint or whatever you're using. The fill button allows you to fill in a shape. Let me show you how. You can easily shut fill off by clicking the teardrop. You'll notice there's lots of other options down here. You don't really need to mess with them. The only one that's really important is the size and you just slide the bar to change the size. But you can get on and play with the other ones to see what they do. One more thing I want to show you. This is called layering. If you've inserted an image and traced over it, you can go to the layers and delete the image and you have your own hand-drawn sketch. When you're done, you'll go down to the file button and you will commonly export it as a JPEG, a PNG, or a PDF. Then you can upload it to a document or an assignment. Have fun sketching!